Nigeria was able to achieve 42% progress, mainly from children of ages 1 to 5. No significant reduction was made in neonatal components, that is, 0 to 28 days of life. And given the fact that WHO said 80% of neonatal that would die, die within seven days of life. This is why the hospital's neonatal unit decided to address it. As they explained to a selected team of health correspondents to note their feet and ask questions. If Nigeria, the entire spectrum of Nigeria failed and this unit succeeded by this margin, what is it that they have done others haven't done? I think that is the message that Nigerians want. We committed ourselves to the upkeep of this place, not because we are making any money from this place, and not because they are generating money you know, for the upkeep. We use money generated from other units to keep this place because we are committed to it. As it was remarked, in 2009, the unit started a special baby care unit with just one functional incubator. And within four years, neonatal mortality in the unit dropped by almost 77%. We were aware of the economic situation in our country. We, many hospitals do not have functioning incubators. So where it is possible, where the baby is clinically stable and the mother also is fit to do it, we encourage them to practice kangaroo mother care method. The training and retraining of our healthcare system, the nurses have been wonderful. Now the unit has 17 functional incubators that runs for 24 hours and 7 days, powered by alternative energy source. Management of the hospital said, with support from partners, they could do more in UNATA or preterm intervention. In Abuja, Rashidat Mustafa Olagunju, NTA News.